In a normal situation, the cortex has control over the brain, but in addiction, the primitive parts of the brain responsible for survival override the system. Cortex is involved with decision making, working memory, impulse control, and planning, while the limbic system is involved with generating emotions, long term declarative memories, and reward system. Joseph Lee Docks showed that the amygdala can trigger emotional responses before the cortex can even process them. Based on his work, Ruben Volko suggested disrupted connectivity between cortex and limbic regions can cause impaired decision making and emotional regulation. And now that we're surrounded by hundreds of stimulants with rapid fire micro rewards every day, brain simply reroutes the reward circuitry to a new stimulus with enough dopaminergic activation, and this new template doesn't respond to ordinary life and never fully raise. It stays hidden until trauma shatters the quitting habits and relapse happens even years after.